In this video, we will cover updating the firmware. Please note this video was created using Windows 7. When a new firmware is released, please be sure to update the firmware on the printer. There are two ways in which you can update the firmware on the printer. It's by PC, via LAN or USB. First, download and get the firmware from an authorized brother dealer or brother website and save to your desktop for easy location. From the PC desktop, go to the Start menu. Next, select All Programs. Select Brother GTX4 Tools. In this folder, select the GTX-4 Firmware Update Program. Next, a window will populate and ask you to browse to select the firmware you want to use. Click the Browse button. Locate the file that was previously placed onto the desktop. It will end in the extension .bwf. Please ensure that you select this file and only have that one firmware placed on your desktop at the time of the update. With the file selected, click Open. Back of the tool, you may click Next. Be sure to read the on-screen instructions. Also make sure that the printer is powered on. Make sure that the printer is connected via LAN or USB cable to the PC, and the printer is not currently printing. Afterwards, click Next. If you have multiple printers, you'll need to select the proper printer in this list on this page and then click Next. A preview of the different versions of items will be displayed stating it will go from one version to the other during this update. This gives you the opportunity to verify that the versions are different. You may click Next. When you click Next, the update will start. Please take note of the instructions on the screen as the firmware is updating. They will need to be followed in order. After we hit Next, the printer panel will display Updating Firmware and the green print button will start to flash. The amount of time for the update may vary depending on the amount of changes or the file size of the firmware. Once the process is complete, the printer will make a pong sound, and a message will display the update is complete to please power off and power the printer back on. Please do so and let the printer return to the standby screen before returning to the program on the PC to finish out the process. Back on the PC, click the Confirm checkbox and then click Next. This will take you to the confirmation screen where you may click Finish. If you receive some error on the screen stating the firmware did not update, please attempt the process again from the beginning. If this fails, then please contact your brother authorized dealer about the matter. If you need additional support, please fill out our web form at brotherdtg.com forward slash help for further assistance.